This is quite a mess. Gee, what a dump. Are we really gonna stay here? Hey, you made this mess! Oh my! I didn't know you cared! How sweet. Oh. Welcome. It's a long trip. Thanks for coming all the way. Well, thank you for inviting us back again. <laughs> Here you go. Mm -hmm. Boys, you get to work repairing the damage. Girls, you start on cleaning, laundry, and cooking. Huh? <gasps> but we're tired. Can't we rest a little bit first? What did you say? Me? Oh, nothing. We should probably do what she says. That's right. Come on, let's go now. Excuse me, ma'am. Pardon me. What's my assignment to be? You're new, aren't you? Yes, I am. How do you do? My name is Washu, and I am at your service, oh, great respected one. Well, well, for being so young and all, you are a good, polite girl, and I like that. Now, I'm not planning on making any children do any work, so why don't you run along with Sir Sammy and play? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Huh? Hmm. Washu, you slacker! Ouch! Just what the... Quit wasting my time. <laughs> ah, Nubuyuki. I thought you were a party of eight, but it looks like we got one more guest. Huh? Eh? What are you talking about? There are only eight of us. That's strange. I could swear I saw a young lady resembling me as a young woman. Well, there's no one like that with us. Not at all. She's starting to see things. Watch out. I said get to work and I mean it. Yes, yes ma'am. Ma Shall we go? Okay. Hmm. Hey, Ayeka. Hmm? Uh, nothing. Never mind. All right. Come on now, Sasami. Okay. This is a milfoil. Did you know these flowers are supposedly grown for their beauty and medicinal values? But I wonder what they cure. Sasami! Huh? Come over here, Sasami! Come on, it's a wonderful view, it really is! <sighs> oh. mm -hmm. Sasami! What? Where'd she go? Oh, well, Rio Oki is with her, so she'll be fine, I'm sure. This must be what she had in mind when she called and invited us over. Hmm, I was so stupid. Let's just say naive. <laughs> well, you were excited about coming here, too. Did you say something? Uh, uh, no, nothing, nothing. <laughs> 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 I told you to be careful. Boneheads. Hey, Tenchi, look. Hmm? Oh, now no. who's a bonehead? big help with the way you're peeling, then we won't have anything left to eat. Is that right? Well, with how slowly you're peeling them, we're never gonna finish, Madam Slowpoke. Mm-hmm. Well, at least I have a talent for not wasting food. What are you saying? The truth! Mm. Uh, settle down, both of you. I mean, let's not argue over nothing, okay? I mean, at least wait till it's something to argue about. Mm. Uh. Oh. Oh. What? Hmm. Hey, I didn't do any.
anything. <sighs> it wasn't me, I tell you. I really didn't do anything, and you better believe me. Sesame, was it you? No. Oh, Aika. Hmm? Did you see someone else here just now? No, Aika, I didn't. Meow. I thought I saw someone. Aika, I need hey, to tell Aika, you... Hey, Aika, what was it? Oh, nothing! Uh, Sesame, you were saying... Uh, Nothing, really. Huh? Hmm. Please, hold it tight, Grandpa. I know. Hurry up. Hmm? <laughs> ah. uh, did... did you... did you see that? Telling you what we saw. We saw a vague, ghost-like figure. Oh, okay, you you guys are just trying to scare me now, right? No, we actually saw it. Mm. You saw it? Yes. <laughs> Come to think of it, Dad and Grandpa said they saw something, something similar. Stop it, please! I can't stand it! I can't stand it! What are you afraid of, Tenshi? Hey, do I look afraid? Huh? Uh, Grandpa! Listen, I'll tell you the story. When I was a young man, the person who lived here told it to me. It begins over 600 years ago. There was a house on a mountain, far away from civilization. In it there lived a couple. People respected and admired their relationship because they were so much in love. However, the wife had been sickly since childhood and had become bedridden for quite some time. It is said she probably knew that her time was running short. They did their best trying to care for each other and live their lives to the fullest and to treasure their remaining time together. One stormy night, they heard a voice through the howling wind. It wasn't their imagination. The voice was real. Though they were scared, they were compelled to listen, and this is what the voice said to them. Head to the west. Go over three mountains, and you'll find an herb that can cure any kind of sickness. Thus the wind spoke, and then fell silent. The husband believed the wind's words, and decided to go search for the herb. She begged him to remain, and not leave her alone, but he left and set out for the west. Huh? Ow! For six months, she waited for his return, holding on against death with all her strength. But he didn't return. She spoke to herself, saying, I wish that I were healthy. Then I would be able to look for him. But, alas, her hopes were in vain. And one day, all alone, she passed away. After that day, around this place, people began to see an image of a woman. They call her the White Ghost. So you'd better watch out, Tenchi. Hmm? Her spirit wanders aimlessly, searching for her beloved, constantly searching. She may even come for you. Hey! Ah! 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 Haven't you rested long enough? Get back to work! Oh, yes, yes ma'am! Oh. Kids today! Hey! That goes for you, too, I hope you know. But... but I... the white ghost is... Not the white ghost! That old story of yours again? You! Your story? That... you made it all up? <laughs> yep. Not mad, are you? Cut it out! <laughs> Don't fix the lights or something. When will they ever grow up? Why am I the one who has to fix this? Dad and Grandpa are always sitting around doing nothing. Huh? 
So what if Grandpa's story was all made up? I mean, we all did see that white image. Haha, <laughs> I better stop thinking about ghosts or I'll probably see one. <laughs> Hey. Jeez, silly me. It's just a stupid can. something. Where did you see it exactly? Uh, uh, huh? Ah! huh? <laughs> My imagination. Sasami? Uh, uh. Sasami? Not so tight! <laughs> Sasami, it's only you. I can't breathe. <laughs> My, that was so scary. I thought it was. Uh... Huh? Look, Sasami's reflection is. Uh huh? Oh! <gasps> Tsunami. Oh my, Sasami. not around here anywhere. I look, she's not inside the inn. Wash you? Hmm, nope. I've checked. My instruments can't seem to find a trace of her. Oh, no. I can't communicate with Rio Oki now, either. Ah, we'll just have to spread out and search for her ourselves. Well, I'll go this way. All right. Huh, let's see. I'll go this way, then... Hmm. You! Ooh. Go that way. <laughs> 